Hey there everyone, how's it going? I know this game came out decades ago. I don't care. It still doesn't change the fact that I love it and will always consider Gran Turismo 2 to be one of the most iconic racing games of all time. But I'm not here to review this game, obviously. Instead, I want to show you how to get a lot of money very quickly. There's a lot of different methods that people have come up with over the years, and I could technically go over like six or seven different ways, but I'm only going to focus on one method, simply because I like this one the most, and realistically, I think it's one of the more easier methods if you are halfway decent at racing games. So with that said, let's get started here. First thing you're going to need to do is obtain your B license. However, you need to get all the gold trophies. This is important because you'll be awarded a Honda Spoon S2000 that will be used in your first race. After you obtain the B license and the S2000, go ahead and obtain the rest of your licenses. It does not matter if you place gold or bronze, it's totally fine. Doing all the license challenges is by far the longest part of this entire process. The rest is only going to take you like 10 minutes, give or take, so just be patient. Okay, so once you get that all taken care of, go ahead and get inside that S2000 and upgrade it slightly. Now, this is not entirely necessary because you can win the upcoming race with this car being stock, but truthfully, I am not that fantastic at racing games, so upgrading the car with that 10,000 that you are given at the very start is more than enough to help me. Now all I really did here was add a racing exhaust, threw on a computer chip, and called it good. If you do have additional credits for whatever reason, upgrading the transmission and tires will significantly help as well, but again, none of that is totally necessary. Now you're ready to start your first race. For that, you're going to go to Special Events, then slide over to the 80s Sports Car Cup. The very last race is Tahiti Road. This is the one you're going to want to race on. And thankfully, it's only a three lap race and Tahiti Road is a very short track. So this race should only really take you under four minutes. Once you win, you'll get 10,000 on top of a brand new car a Skyline Silhouette Formula valued at 125,000 credits. Now, don't sell this car, you're gonna need it for the next step. However, you can repeat this same race on Tahiti Road, and every single time you come in first, you get awarded another Skyline. So you can sell duplicates if you want to. Anyway, what you're gonna wanna do now is get in that Skyline and go back to special events. But this time we're gonna go all the way to Gran Turismo All-Stars. Then we're gonna race on Red Rock Valley. Now I'll warn you, this race is a little bit difficult, but with enough effort and concentration, you should do just fine. The race is gonna take five laps, so you do have enough leeway to make a few mistakes early on, but still just be a little careful. The AI is prone to making mistakes from time to time as well, so that is going to help you. This race should take about six minutes total, so not all too bad really. And once you do win and come in first place, you'll get awarded 50,000 credits. You'll also get a very expensive prize car, a Speed 12, a 500,000 credit car that again can be awarded to you over and over again. That is my preferred method of getting cash stupid quick in this game. Like I said, there's plenty of other methods that people have. Also, if you want to take this a step further, you could technically repeat the Red Rock Valley race a few times and sell that Speed 12 and go and purchase an Escudo Pikes Peak for 2 million credits from the Suzuki dealer. And you basically now have one of the best cars in the entire game. So that's really all there is to it. I know the game is old, and making a tips video for Gran Turismo 2 in 2021 is a bizarre thing to do, but it doesn't matter to me. If you guys are curious as to other methods to get fast cash extremely quick, I'm not opposed to making a separate video on it. Or if you have another way to get fast cash that I'm not even aware of, let me know in the comments. 
That being said, thank you all so much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Take care, everyone.